horror fanatics. This is JAR369. Welcome back for another brand new video review. Well, today I'll be taking a look at the Pop Movies It number 4, 537, 38, 39, 40, 41, 72, and 73. The Losers Club, we got the leader, Ben. Ben. I mean, I'm sorry, Bill, Ben, Beverly, Richie, beep, beep, Richie, Eddie, Mike, and of course, Stanley by Funko. Now, take a look at the packagings here. Well, they're pretty much exactly the same box. You get like the, um, it packaging here. You get like the characters head on in. You get the it logo there on the side. You get the characters image there. On the side and their names on the top same thing here and on the back here you got other pops in this line such as the loser the losers club uh, pennywise with spider legs and of course georgie so that's about it for each of these packaging now let's release all of these pops out of the box here we got all of the losers club out of the box now now let me start off with Beverly Lee Marsh. Now the head, the like, now the head likeness to the actress who played Beverly, I think it looks pretty, pretty decent. I mean, take a look of her. You can see some of the freckles on her face here, and also you get like this little small dirt on her. The dress is pretty much like the one she wore in the in the movie where. Where she gets kidnapped by Pennywise and some like that. Also, there's like a little little key on her her necklace here, or I guess that's a key. I have no idea. You can see like the wristband here. You get the her ring. Nothing. Well, you can see there's like another ring here. There's another ring where the pinky is, and her dress is pretty basically on her flowers here. I mean. You can see some of the flowers are printed in. You can see some of her, not her shoes has some molded shoelaces here. Not pretty much. There's also the chase variant of her where she's all bloody because of the because of all the um because of the Pennywise trying to kill her or something. I don't know. So that's about it for Beverly. Now let's take a look at Ben. I mean, I'm sorry, Mike. Take a look at Mike here. I think it looks pretty well done. I think it looks really cool. I mean, nothing much to it. Now, you see he's just... I mean, nothing much on the shirt, nor pants, nothing. I mean, you get the, his comforts, which is... You see some of the printed shoelaces there. And also, you can see, like, the... The fly there. And also, you get, like, all the bullets for this gun here that kills all the sheep, including... Henry Bowers trying to kill him, but then he just missed it and later push him off. Yeah, I mean, you get the bullets there, and also there's the uh, button here for the shirt. Pretty, and also the gun is pretty much painted in all silver and black, and also no idea was this extra piece there. Uh, you can clearly see full detail of the gun here, and also. There's like a little mist paint there, so be careful with that. So that's about it for um, Mike. Now let's look at Stutter Bill. Bit, a bit, a bit, Billy Boy. Eh. Now the likeness to the actor who played Bill, I think looks really cool. I think the likeness is really great job, dead on to the actor. No, so take a look at the um, shirt here. There's like pretty much like mess up shirt here, like like one here. I mean, you better be careful with buying pots because or else there's like messed up shirts there, like messy paints. You can see he is wearing the backpack here, and you can see like he is holding the flashlight here. And also you get the watch here. You can see the little fly on the um, pants there, the jeans. And also you get like the shoes here that are that are, that are um molded shoelaces there. 
And that's about it for Bill. Now let's look at Ben. I mean, the likeness to the um, the actor who played Ben is dead on. I think it looks really cool. Now you get the his shirt here, which is a, a wolf shirt right here. And also he is holding the egg that he found in the library. And it's funny enough, it glows in the dark, which I'm going to show you in a minute now. Uh, nothing else on the back here. The pants, nothing else. And the shoes, uh, nothing else there. And also, let's get to the feature where his egg glows in the dark. Let me just turn off the light. Do, 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 do. I mean, it glows really great, but then it just like fades out easily. Let's try this again. Do, 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 do. I mean, you can see it glows. I mean, it glows perfectly fine. Now let's turn on, turn on the light back on. There we go. So there you have it. There is Ben. Now let's look at Eddie. I mean, the likeness to the um, actor, like I said, dead on to him. Oh, oh, ah. Here we got Eddie. I mean the the likeness to the um to the actor who played him. I think it looks really cool. It looks dead on to the actor. I mean no, nothing else to it. Now take a look at his outfit here. It's pretty much accurate to the one that he he wore in the movie. Pretty much. And also you got the uh, the watch here. Come on, focus, folks. Focus. There we go. You can see his watch there on his wrist there. And also you can see he is holding his thing for his asthma, which is he doesn't have it because of his overprotective mother. And also you get his fanny back there. Now, and also, you get the bandages on here, and, and look, they added the word loser, I mean lover, which is the, which is the cooler, coolest thing Funko ever done. Uh, nothing else on the pants there, nothing else on the shoes. I mean, you see some of the molded, those are Felgrope's shoes. You can see some of the Felgrope's there, and that's about it for Eddie. Now, let's look at Richie. Who is played by Finn Wolfhard. I mean, the head scope is, I think it's pretty much exactly the same head as the, um, as Mike Wheeler from Stranger Things because, hey, they both played, they both played by Finn Wolfhard. I mean, the head scope is pretty much exactly the same as Mike Wheeler's head from Stranger Things. Now, take a look at the outfit here. You see all the tropical tree islands there on his shirt there. Nothing much to it. You can see the shirt underneath it here, white shirt. Uh, whoops. And also you get like the creases on his pants here. And also you can see he's wearing like the sh shoelaces less shoes, which is ha doesn't have shoelaces. The glass is a pretty much a separate piece. I mean, you get like the um, the glass there and all that stuff. And you can see he's holding the bat for beating up Pennywise. I mean, it looks pretty cool. So that's about it for Richie. Now, lastly, we got Stanley. Which is, I'm pretty sure he's going to die in the chapter 2. Where Ben calls him, but he decided not to do it because... And then he later on committed suicide. Just like the miniseries does. Take a look at the head scope here. I think it looks pretty much like the actor who played him. I think it looks really cool. I think it looks really great. I absolutely liked it a lot. I think it looks really cool. You can see some of the blood all over him. Pretty much because Pennywise disguised as a um, the creepy painting from the... Um, the from his... Um, fear of the creepy painting because of and then he later on bits bits him 
And also the white, sh and also you get the burgundy shirt on him. You can see some of the um, buttons here. You get like the, you get the holding his pipe for the beating up Pennywise. And of course you can see he's wearing his wristwatch here. Nothing else to it. Nothing else on the pants. And also you get the shoes here that's molded with shoelaces there. And in the bottom of each of these figures, the pops, they all came with Lego craft. So overall, I think this set looks really cool. I absolutely like this set a lot. I think it looks really cool. I mean, I really wish Funko could make like a seven pack of the Losers Club. You know, like Eddie, Richie, whoops. Uh, and all the characters from this line. I mean, they're pretty much basically exactly the same as the these common ones. I mean, hey, what do you expect? They're just pretty much exactly the same. I mean, for overall, I say these pops looks really cool. Especially the Ben, ben Henscom pop, which is a light-up egg, which is really cool. I think it looks really great. All these sets are really cool. I highly recommend getting all the Losers Club if you're a big IT fan. So that's about it. Make sure to tune in for new videos daily. Don't forget to turn on the bell icon to be notified of new videos after you subscribe. And of course, follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Both the links will be in the description down below. This is JAR369 and goodbye. Oh, come back anytime. Bring your friends. <laughs>